There were several autonomous administrative divisions of India to which the central government has given varying degrees of autonomy within the state legislature. The establishment and functions of most of these autonomous councils are based on the sixth schedule to the Constitution of India. In Assam in Assam there are three autonomous councils under sixth schedule of the Indian constitution. The three autonomous councils are <inaudible> Bodoland Territorial Council the Bodoland Territorial Council BTC has legislative, administrative, executive and financial powers over 40 policy areas in the Bodoland Territorial Areas districts comprising four administrative districts as Udalgori, Baksa, Chirang, Kakraihar comprising various protected tribal belts and blocks in Assam and 40 elected representatives to the BTC Legislative Assembly and provisions for six nominated members to be nominated by the Governor of Assam from the unrepresented communities in the BTC CLA through direct election in the districts of Assam. It was established in 2003 following a peace agreement between the Government of India and Bodo Liberation Tigers and is functioning since 2003 under the provision of the amended Sixth Schedule of the Constitution of India. The first Chief Executive Member of the BTC was Hagrama Mohilari. Its predecessor body Bodoland Autonomous Council was functional with lesser power. Its headquarters is at Kakraihar town in Kakraihar district. Topic: <inaudible> Dima Haseo Autonomous District Council. Topic: The Dima Haseo Autonomous District Council (DHADC) is an autonomous council constituted under the provisions of the 6th schedule of the Constitution of India to administer the district and to develop the Dimasa people. Its headquarter is Haflong in Dima Haseo district. Topic: <laughs> Karbi Anglong Autonomous District Council. Topic: The Karbi Anglong Autonomous District Council, East Karbi Anglong (KAADC) is an autonomous council in the district constituted under the provision of the 6th schedule of the Constitution of India for the development of Karbi people. Its headquarter is Difu in East Karbi Anglong district. Topic Others. Topic Diori Autonomous Council, Mizing Autonomous Council, Raba Hasong Autonomous Council, Sanawal Kachari Autonomous Council, Thangal Kachari Autonomous Council, Tiwa Autonomous Council. In Manipur Sadar Hills Autonomous District Council The Sadar Hills Autonomous District Council covers Cycle Subdivision, Situ Subdivision and Sadar Hills West Subdivision in Senapati District of Manipur. It is one of the six autonomous district councils in Manipur state. Others Chandal Autonomous District Council Churashanpur Autonomous District Council Senapati Autonomous District Council Taminglong Autonomous District Council Ukral Autonomous District Council In Jammu and Kashmir Ladakh Autonomous Hill Development Council, Kargil Kargil is a district of Ladakh, Kashmir, India. Kargil lies near the line of control facing Pakistan administered Kashmir's Gilgit Baltistan to the west, and Kashmir Valley to the south. Following demands of Ladakhi people to make the district a new Indian Union territory because of its religious and cultural differences with Kashmir. The Government of India formed the Ladakh Autonomous Hill Development Council which governs the area with limited autonomy. 
Ladakh Autonomous Hill Development Council, Leh. Topic. Leh is one of the two districts of Ladakh. Following widespread agitations to make it a union territory of India due to the cultural and linguistic differences with Kashmir the Government of India formed the Ladakh Autonomous Hill Development Council which governs this area with limited political autonomy. The first elections for the LAHDC were held in the year 1995. In Meghalaya Topic. Garo Hills Autonomous District Council topic. The Garo Hills Autonomous District Council GHADC is constituted for the development of Garo people and covers East Garo Hills District, West Garo Hills District, South Garo Hills, North Garo Hills District and South West Garo Hills District. It has headquarter in Tura. Topic. Jainsha Hills Autonomous District Council The Jainsha Hills Autonomous District Council is constituted for the development of Jainsha people. It has headquarter in Joai and covers the Jainsha Hills District. Kasi Hills Autonomous District Council the Kasi Hills Autonomous District Council is constituted for the development of Kasi people covers West Kasi Hills District, East Kasi Hills District and Re Bhoi District, it has headquarter in Shillong. In Mizoram Chakma Autonomous District Council Topic. Chakma Autonomous District Council is an autonomous council for the Chakma people living in the southwestern part of Mizoram. Topic. Lai Autonomous District Council Topic. Lai Autonomous District Council is an autonomous council for the Lai people in the southeastern part of Mizoram. Topic. Mara Autonomous District Council Topic. Mara Autonomous District Council is an autonomous council for the Mara people living in the southern part of Mizoram. Topic. In Tripura Topic. Topic. Tripura Tribal Areas Autonomous District Council The Tripura Tribal Areas Autonomous District Council is an independent council administering the tribal areas of the state of Tripura. Its council and assembly are situated in Kumulwing, a town 20 km outside Agartala, the state capital. In West Bengal Topic. Topic. Gorkhaland Territorial Administration Topic. Gorkhaland Territorial Administration GTA is a semi-autonomous administrative body for the Darjeeling Hills in West Bengal, India. The GTA replaced the Darjeeling Gorkha Hill Council, which was formed in 1988 and administered the Darjeeling Hills for 23 years. GTA presently has three hill subdivisions Darjeeling, Kalimpong, and Kursang and some areas of Siliguri subdivision under its authority. It has headquarter in Darjeeling. <laughs> De facto autonomous area <laughs> North Sentinel Island North Sentinel Island is situated in the island chain of the Andaman and Nicobar Islands which is a union territory of India. It is home to the Sentinelese people, who are some of the world's last uncontacted peoples. 
They reject any contact with other people and are among the last people to remain virtually untouched by modern civilization. There has never been any treaty with the people of the island nor any record of a physical occupation. The local government Andaman and Nicobar Islands has stated that they have no intention to interfere with the Sentinelese's lifestyle or habitat. Although the island is likely to have suffered seriously from the effects of the December 2004 tsunami, the survival of the Sentinelese was confirmed when, some days after the event, an Indian government helicopter observed several of them, who shot arrows at the hovering aircraft to repel it. Although this has not been done with any formal treaty, the official policy of minimal interference has ensured that they have de facto autonomy and sovereignty over their island under the framework of the Indian and local governments. See also Topic States and territories of India List of autonomous areas by country Topic References Topic Topic External links Topic. <laughs>